Thought leadership for individuals and organizations is quite different. And in fact, in this day and age, it's really become an imperative. But this isn't about influence and impact. This is about rebuilding trust. When I got home, my friend told me about this thing called the Edelman Trust Report. You may or may not have heard of it. It is an annual report that studies the global trends around trust. And here's what I learned. 2017 is the year of trust in crisis. Think about that. Trust in crisis. But we're all feeling it, aren't we? Right? We've lost faith in our institutions. We've lost faith in our government, in the media, in the church, in pharmaceutical companies, in banks. I could go on. But I'm not really a person who likes to focus so much on the problem. I like to focus on the solution. And I would love to stand up here today and in the next 10 minutes tell you how to solve this. But I do believe instead that I'm going to start a conversation because I think it's going to take all of us working together to create the solutions to turn this tide. Rebuilding trust is going to take all of us because indeed, we are feeling overwhelmed, but so is everyone else. And the people in this room, we are the leaders, the informal and the formal leaders that people look to. They look to us to be trustworthy. They look to us to have the answer. They look to us to be leaders that they can follow with moral courage to take on those who need to be held accountable. They look to us to be the kind of people who can be transparent and vulnerable and can listen. 